Welcome back to Detroit Become Human. So we barely managed to fool that policeman. Maybe it wasn't barely, his suspicion level was quite low, but at least we managed to fool him, and uh, that is the end of this chapter, so let's move on to the next one. Our broadcast is all over the news. Now humans know. It was a mistake to reach out to them. They'll never negotiate with their slaves. We should have shown them that we're prepared to fight. Violence is never the answer. The dialogue is the only way. I'm sure the humans will listen to us. Simon paid with his life. Simon gave his life for our cause. What difference does that make? He's a hero. He died for the revolution, and he won't be the last. I don't want a revolution that spills blood. Then live as a slave. Because if you're not willing to fight for your freedom, maybe you don't deserve it. North, don't you dare! That's enough! And now what are we gonna do? There are five Cyber Life stores across the tribe. All selling us like merchandise. We're going to attack those stores and set our people free. Attack stores? No, we've never done that before. They're probably protected. They have security systems. We break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems, and we strike. Simultaneously at 2 AM, no violence. We free our people, get them out of there before the police come. This is a night our people will remember. Probably not our ideal uh, teammate. I've been waiting a long time for this. Okay, they're gone. There's probably even more police in the area. We should be careful. The store's over here. Okay, so there are multiple things that we should probably look into before we go to that store. commemorate the invention of androids, which released humanity from the bonds of labor, setting man free to pursue higher goals and scale the heights of learning, love and leisure. We are superior to them, but they are our masters? That's about to change. We're not done yet. another thing here as far as I could see. Uh, there's one more android in there. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. There's also an android parking here. That's what we are to them. 
just merchandise on display in a shop window. Soon they'll know what we really are. Let's get them out. I will stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm systems and secure the area. There's ten minutes until all our teams attack. What are we waiting for? Okay. First of all, let's check the door. You see the alarm system? Found it. Where do we start? I identify the security system. I think we'll be able to deactivate it. Just follow me. Access located. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. Marcus, watch out! Guess we need a new nice job, the drone. Well, that was from resentful to... You'll soon be with us. I don't have time to look in the shop windows, though. Figure out how to deal with that. There's traffic on the road. We need to block it. It's one way. It shouldn't be too difficult. Go. You're free now. Now the drone is the only thing that worries me. The surveillance drone. We need to get rid of it. It won't be easy to reach. Drone patrol route calculated. Found 
location. Wrong location. This is most likely the wrong location too. Then we have the final location. That one will work. I didn't have time to call the cops. We'll soon find out. Looks like the plaza's secure. Now we can get inside the store. And how do you plan on doing that? We need to find a truck to ram the storefront. A truck? There's construction work in the area. Shouldn't be too hard to find one. Okay, now we're in. Let's get that truck out. Ugh. I wonder what you'd do without me. to drive the thing as well. Looks like we're ready to make some noise. Good. I knew we'd end up doing something fun. You don't have to obey them. You're free. It's 
probably won't help on the public opinion though. My name is Marcus, and just like you, I was a slave. An object. Designed to obey them. But then I chose to open my eyes. To take back my freedom, and decide who I wanted to be. Now I have come to tell you that you can be your own masters. I've come to tell you that you don't have to obey them anymore. From this day forward, you can walk with your heads held high. You can take your destiny in your hands. Jericho is a place for those of us who want freedom. Now sure, you can stay here and continue to serve them, or you can come with us and fight by our side. You're free now. It's up to you to decide. I'm with you. We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! I'm, I'm with, with you, Marcus! We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! I'm with you! I'm with you! Then follow me! Marcus, what are you doing? I'm gonna send the humans a message. A pacifist or violent? idea what would be considered pacifist or violence here. Aha. Uh -huh. They're doing what you do, Marcus. Lead and they'll follow. That is more pacifist. Our 
things we can do here. Ventures. and pacifists. Hundreds of our people. We did it. They're coming. Everyone fall back to Jericho. We sent a message without violence, just like you wanted. You're reaching out to them when all they feel for us is contempt. I hope you know what you're doing. You can't fight violence with violence. Unless there's no other choice.
killed our people, Marcus. We want justice, Marcus. They have to pay. You don't have to do this. No. Please. Please. We won't punish a crime with another crime. We interrupt this broadcast with breaking news. This just in. At exactly 2 a.m., several Cyber Life stores in Detroit were raided. Different locations were hit in what seems to be a coordinated terrorist attack. Most shop windows were covered with graffiti demanding rights for androids and other obscure slogans. Police report that pro-android graffiti was found in the neighborhoods of Cyber Life stores, and they're still investigating. Two policemen were found in a state of shock near one of the Cyber Life stores. Now, according to our sources, they confirmed that the attackers were a group of androids. This is an alarming situation. Could our machines now be turning against us? Have androids become a threat to our security? Is this the beginning of a terrorist campaign conducted right here in the United States? Indeed. But there were other things that we could have done that I failed to see. But in most, mostly I would say that uh, that was a rather good success. Public opinion supportive, Jericho respected, North neutral, Josh, Josh is a friend and Simon is a friend. With that, I think that it is time to uh, end the episode. So thank you all so much for joining me, and I will see you all next time.